So today we're going to be on the most dangerous road here in Beam and G Drive. It is a new challenge by Spieler and folks it's going to be tough because we're going to try it with the poopy car and we're going to try it also with a very capable off-roader. Do you guys think we're going to make it to the end? Also comment down below for suggestions to modify this challenge and let's jump in. Okay so we're ready to traverse the most dangerous road here in Beam and G Drive. So this challenge we're going to be using an older vehicle. Now it is a uh, I think it's a Cummins swap. Uh, this thing sounds uh, pretty mean uh, but yeah now this is something I do want to do more of in the future maybe we'll do it with like a semi truck and maybe we'll do this with random parts but yeah this is made by Spieler let's go ahead and start the uh, descent here uh, if I crash I must reset I don't think there's actually much of a hurry to go down fast and oh my goodness this road yeah there's no guardrails on this that i can see uh so yeah there's two versions of this map also uh there's a rainy version which i'm assuming might be a little on the slick side i just hit a oh, okay we're good i nailed that rock okay be careful here uh, we just gotta get down the road uh, everything's fine i mean it's a beautiful map i kind of do want to fly off the cliff and see what's down there and oh wow okay i really do want to do this with the semi truck and trailer i feel like it might be impossible uh but yeah that would definitely be a very fun challenge uh, so I have a couple things planned for this map, but today we just want to actually do the run itself and see how possible it is. Right now, it's not too bad, to be honest with you. Oh my goodness. Wait, what are we... Okay, we're still just going down. Wait, is it going to go back up? That's a good question. There is a in part of this map. There should be two roads. Why is this not turning? I think I broke something in my right front. I feel like the car is leaned over when I hit that rock. Uh, this might be a nightmare for later on. Uh, oh my goodness. It doesn't turn to the left at all. I think I'm going to have to use the handbrake to make it turn. And oh! Oh, you know, if I can complete this, I would say maybe I get to like pick out whatever car I want to try to do this. Maybe something a little bit more high performance. But I think the uh, the spirit of the challenge is to have something a little bit more on the junky slower side. I uh, definitely got a decent engine in here, though. Like this is uh, doing a pretty good job so far. All right. Keep your eyes peeled. There's a lot of rocks in the road here. Oh, my goodness. Oh, why won't you turn to the left? <laughs> Oh, that's so bad. Actually, I don't think I have steering in my left front. Oh, there it goes. Oh, this is a really weird vehicle. All right, let's keep going. Uh, we got this. All right, so we're starting to climb up here. Uh, it's still, it just doesn't turn. My right front's actually turning. It's my left front that's busted. I didn't even hit anything. Oh, it's wobbling. Uh, yeah, that might be an issue later on. Uh, okay, come on. Pay attention. Uh, we're going up. I don't know how big this map is. I mean, you could see across it here. I hope the road doesn't go all the way through there. Oh my goodness, come on. Uh, why won't you turn? I, I might just reset back to the start. I'm not really sure. Uh, this is really, really bad. The road's not too bad so far, though. Like, I, I feel like we can easily get back to this spot. Okay, we're coming back up. I think this is right around the same area where we uh, just stopped. I went ahead and just reset. That way, uh, I had a vehicle that is capable of driving through this. So I was really careful at the start here. Uh, I don't know how long this road is. I, I think we'll be fine on gas. I haven't used much, uh, so we should be good there and oh my goodness oh my get white wiser oh this is getting bad okay uh there's no way you can do this with a semi i almost want to do the semi thing now no there's no way it won't fit through i mean technically it would probably fit it would be extremely close though so maybe we'll try the semi this episode we'll do the uh the random parts let's continue this with the car let's see if we can make it through that first and then uh we'll maybe just do one run with the semi uh, oh my goodness this is yeah this is something now it's definitely ramping up in difficulty uh it was actually really easy and i was kind of afraid that it was going to be all the same but no well we're definitely getting into a little bit more of a challenge here oh my goodness okay it just instantly went off road and wait is this the i think this is the road oh there are some hidden rocks in the grass here uh, am I on the... Did I leave the right path? Uh, okay, no, I'm assuming this is still the same road. Okay, come on. You can do this. Oh, my engine is struggling to get up this. Uh, you know, surprisingly, I don't have any damage right now. Like, I haven't hit anything. Knock on wood. I probably just jinxed myself. Uh, was that... Is that a freaking banana? Hold on. We must back up. I am really confused. It's the world's largest banana. Okay, well that was uh, that was really random. Uh, now I kind of wonder what other secrets might be in the jungle. <laughs> okay, we're still on the road, I think. Uh, there's a warehouse in here. Is there, is there something back in there? Hold on, what does that even say? Let's just read it real quick. Proceed only when the scale is completely. Is this like a? Wait, is this a wait station? Well, it was a wait station. Hold on, is there anything back here? No. Okay, well that's kind of weird, folks. I think, I think I broke a part of the steering again. 
Like, it's turning ability is gone. I must have hit a small rock. I don't know. This is actually wasn't a good vehicle to choose, but that's in the spirit of the challenge. So, uh, yeah, cruddy vehicle it is. All right. I don't know how much further we have to go. Uh, there's some tricky areas back there. I still think doing this with a semi would be... I want to say borderline impossible, but I'm not going to say uh, no. And oh my goodness. Holy. What the? Okay. No way we would be able to haul something up this, right? I would need like a modded semi that has like a million horsepower. Uh-oh. Uh no. That's not good. Will that keep me off? Uh, okay. Try to hit it with some speed here. Oh, it's pushing. It's pushing. Oh my goodness. Okay. That was actually kind of neat. Dude, that's a nice looking one. Hold on, let's admire Spieler's waterfall real quick. Oh, that's nice. Um, it wouldn't be nice to fall off into the water. Wait a minute, water source. Does this mean we could do flood escape on this map too? <laughs> I'm gonna have uh, plenty of videos planned out for this thing. Okay, come on. Yeah, I feel like the semi wouldn't be a video in itself because I, I don't think you're gonna make it. So we'll definitely try it. Oh no, it's another waterfall. Okay, let's hit it with some speed here. No, 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 no. Oh, it does push you. It's not too bad. Like it definitely looks like it's flowing faster than it like feels. Like I thought we were gonna get yeeted right off, but uh, we're good. Oh my goodness, my turning is it's just gone. I feel like I'm turning a dump truck right now. Uh, come on. I just have to tap the handbrake to help like get it to rotate. All right, we're still going. We're in this still. Uh, this is kind of amazing. Yeah, I'm kind of I'm looking down at like the lake down there, and I'm trying to figure out if there's a road by there. I'm curious as to if this like intertwines with itself. Uh, cause yeah, I have no, since I haven't been on the, the map at all, like I have no reference to figure out if we're at the end. Wait a minute. Okay. I'm going to pause here. Minister editor person. Uh, actually, you know what? I'll just assist here. Uh, I'm going to look in that direction. Do you see the road over there? Dude, there's like a road. Wait, have we been on that road? <gasps> we haven't. That's uh, that's extra waterfalls. Oh my, this is a big road. <laughs> <laughs> it's just now hitting me how big this challenge actually is. All right, let's keep moving. Uh, we're going to journey all the way to the other side. Oh, boy. Um, I just blew out the oil pan. Uh, I bottomed out. I didn't even like... Oh, no. I didn't do anything. So now we got an oil leak. Uh, so... I guess it's only a matter of time before the engine locks up. Oh, my. That's... That's going to suck. Like, I don't feel... Like, I thought this was going to be a quicker run. I don't feel like resetting to the beginning is really an option because I didn't even do anything really wrong there. I mean, the vehicle just bottomed out a little bit and it blew up in the oil pan. We're going to hope that it just lasts. Uh, maybe it's just a, like a really, really tough engine. Okay. Pay attention here. Tons of rocks. Ooh, oh, that sounded terrible. Uh-oh. Uh uh-uh. I barely hit that rock. My rear drive shaft's broken. You've got to be kidding me. Uh, can we turn on the headlights in here? I like how I was advised to take a poopy car, and now I'm kind of wishing I had like an off-road sunburst or something, because this is definitely tougher. Can I get a reference for how far I am in there? Oh my goodness, this map is huge. What the? I feel like there's a road around this whole thing, and then it goes through the center of the map. Wow. All right, well, we've uh, we've leaked out all of our oil. This is fine. Okay, so I'm going to change the rules a little bit because using a bad vehicle that's ready to fall apart is... I guess maybe we could do it eventually later down the line when I learn the, the path a little bit, but we're going to use this Toyota 4Runner. This was a mod that was on the Beam and G forums. I'll try to locate it again. I just so happen to still have it. I made a video on this where I linked it. Uh, we're going to go with the off-roading extreme package here. All right, check this out. Now, this should be plenty capable of doing this challenge right uh, but yeah this was a lovely mod I probably checked this thing out it was probably like a year ago it might have been even further back but you know what if there's a vehicle that's gonna get this challenge done uh, it's gonna be this I feel like it can definitely withstand some rock hits and some uh, dropping got plenty of clearance under the vehicle yeah I just feel like we should uh, definitely do it in something like this also one of the challenges is do from the first person which Oh, I don't think I'd be prepared for that. Maybe that would be with like a steering wheel. That'd be a heck of a wheel cam video, to be honest with you. Uh, maybe we'll also do that in the future. But yeah, I'm going to just take my time. We're going to try to get back roughly in the same spot. I know once I get back to the waterfalls, we're pretty close to where we were. Uh, so yeah, uh, we'll see you guys on the other side. Okay, so we're up to the waterfall. I've got a little bit of damage. Uh, I nicked the front of the vehicle and somehow the door popped open. Like it blew out the window. Oh, let's go through the waterfall here. Oh, this is so much easier. Uh, I've been 
cruising around a lot in low gear. I've got everything locked down. Uh, it's handling these off-road sections like a champion. Uh, so I know we're getting close to where we crashed out last time. Uh, we got that running. Oh, dear. Yes, this was definitely the right thing to do. All right, let's go back into high gear when we're on the road. Uh, but yeah, I'll put the range box down into low, especially when we're on like really sketchy sections. Uh, I feel like this forerunner is doing an absolutely fantastic job. Okay, we got to be careful here. This is where we lost the last car, I think. All right, so it was these rocks. All right, should we go? No, I think we can stay in high gear here. We're just we're going down. Just let off. Uh, if we got to roll over a rock, got to roll over a rock. Hold on, turn on the lights here. Oh yeah, that actually works really well. Uh, yeah, the light on this map is great like I would strongly suggest there is a challenge to do this at night but maybe starting on the default time uh, that the map starts on by the way this is available on Spieler's Patreon but yeah uh, it would actually probably benefit no we're gonna go into low gear here it is definitely getting muddy uh, so I just want to try to be careful through here no rush you don't want to bounce off one of these rocks wrong because it could definitely break something under the car I would think that this car is a little bit tougher and could probably handle a lot more but still I've come this far I do not want to reset back to uh, the front of the map uh, but yeah, I was talking. Oh my goodness. I hit something. No, we're good. Yeah, I was talking about the uh, the old semi. I just I don't see it happening But if I make this if I make this finish like here really soon, uh, of course, I don't know if we're towards the end uh, Maybe we'll attempt it. I just don't see it being possible uh, There are some roads here that are just too narrow, but you know what? A man of my word. Uh, we'll try it if we finish this challenge. Also, by the way, oh, that's... Oh, I have roof lights. I was like, man, there's a lot of light coming from just one headlight. I lost a headlight uh, on the way over here. Okay, we're good. All right, let's get up to the next point. Uh, seems like we've cleared that area. Uh, there is water flowing on this road. Oh, it's coming down from... The oh, that's kind of cool looking. Yeah, it's coming down from the top. Look at the rocks on this road. There's definitely been like a landslide or something that's happened here. Or a uh, mudslide. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that water flows to the bottom. This water isn't as tricky as the the big time waterfalls back there. All right, drive through here. Uh, do I have a down tire or is that a graphical thing? Is my... I must have punctured my right front. It's definitely flat. It's still turning. Uh, but yeah, it's definitely having some issues. You know, I'd like to see a feature in BMG if you have spares. Uh, I've seen it in a couple off-roading games. Like, you should be able to, like, change your spare out. I feel like that would be kind of a cool feature. Even though the spare that's on the top of this 4Runner uh, looks... Is it bigger? No, maybe it's not bigger. I was about to say, it kind of looks bigger than the tires that are on the vehicle, but I, I think it's actually the same size. Uh, and I see a climb up here. Oh, jeez. Oh, I think I might have just clipped a rock. Uh, are we good? Uh, yeah, there's something off in my right front right now. Uh, it doesn't feel the greatest, but, you know, it's fine. We're still going here. Uh, I feel like maybe I should have, like, tried to speed through. Oh, my. What the heck? Uh, okay. Yep. No, this is going to break something. Um, oh, man. if we were in that car, we would be absolutely miserable right now. That No way this would be working. Oh, I'm just waiting for it to break. It is, like, bound to happen here. Okay, we got this. Uh, oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay, this, this sucks. This isn't good at all. Okay, here we go. All right, go up the right side. How much more do we have to go here? Uh, this has been going on for a good while. Okay, this uh, this road has more potholes than my hometown. Uh, by the way, we have a lot of potholes. You would never want to bring like a good car to my my town. Uh, you will bottom out and you will break. Okay, there we go. Oh my goodness, I'm shooting off to the left now. I got to pull to the left. I thought I was pulling to the right. Now it's to the left. Oh, those are rocks, aren't they? Oh, geez. Okay, so I'm seeing other parts of the map. Have we been over there yet? I don't know if we have or haven't. I probably should have asked Spieler before I started this challenge. How long is this road? Because this reminds me of that long drive map that I had him do. Uh, where it was, like, extremely long. It feels like that, but it's just way more of an extreme challenge. Uh, oh, my goodness. All right, this is terrible. Yeah, I mean, it's terrible in a good way, though. I'm having a blast right now driving on this dangerous road. Uh, would you guys say this is the most dangerous road in Mimi G? Like, from what you've seen so far? Oh, here we go. Janky Bridge. Yep, you can't have a road on the... Wait, I'm skewed. My left... The left side of the car is that... What the heck is that? Wait. What is that? Um, random piping? Is there, like, a facility somewhere? Uh, but yeah, the left side of the vehicle, like, the left rear, it's point it left like it's actually skewed out like i'm crab walking slightly so something's definitely bent and broke under the vehicle i just don't know what it oh my goodness uh oh okay headlights back on um no, this is good our headlight and overhead lights I, I don't have a right front light right now uh okay 
Yes, this is this is fine. This is a really thin road. Yep, this thing is it. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> I almost died there. Uh, yeah, no way. The semi does not fit on this road. It just, you can't, you can't do it. Now, random parts, you probably can. Uh, it will probably be a miserable experience. I would say that you maybe would give yourself a couple resets since you're probably going to have a bad car. Uh, maybe every time you reset, you have to scramble again. Uh, that might be a way to do the challenge, but uh, my goodness, this is a beautiful, beautiful challenge so far. Uh, all right, watch out over the rocks. My goodness, uh, this is great. Uh, the road just, it's like it keeps getting worse and worse. Uh, I just really, if I bust my, actually, there's a skid plate on this thing, right? Well, everything's moving in the front of this vehicle now. But I believe there's a skid plate, so hopefully it protects me from busting open the radiator. Uh, what is this? Hold on, there's a facility up here. Oh my goodness, I know what this is. This is the end. So we have made it to the end of road number one. So if I reload the map, there's a secondary starting point. Um, should we do it with the semi? Maybe we'll come back and do the secondary uh, in another video. Uh, we can look at it. We'll look at it before we uh, before we exit, but I'm going to go back to the start. We're going to do it with a semi, or we're going to attempt it with a semi. Let's just see how far I can make it. Uh, but yeah, uh, this was an epic map. Okay, so I have the T75 6x6 off-road monster down here. I don't know where I got this mod, um, but will this work? Uh, it looks higher than your standard truck. I, I feel like maybe I it's not going to work 100%, but I feel like this is probably one of the best options. All right, let's get a trailer. All right, so I've got a semi loaded up. Up here uh, we're gonna put a timer how many minutes do you think i'm gonna last on this road i'm gonna go with let's go with three minutes all right so start the timer editor oh my goodness okay this isn't gonna be too bad to begin with i don't think oh yeah this is totally great i mean if i was just a cab only this probably wouldn't be as horrible but man once we get to the sections where it's just like not even a lane wide we're gonna be great oh my goodness i almost just fell off i almost just ended it uh, i'm not really good at like swinging a trailer <laughs> Oh, so, I gotta look down here, make sure we don't... Oh my goodness, if you're afraid of heights, <laughs> that is a terrifying image right there. All right, so keep going, keep going. All right, this is the first section where the road gets pretty funky. Uh, we got this. Uh, maybe I'm gonna make it further than I thought I would. Um, okay, and then I know we're good. Okay, hug up to the road. Oh my goodness. Oh, the trailer's grinding. Wait, did I just... I just high center. Wait, how do you not do that? Uh, reverse it? Oh my goodness, I can't believe that happened. Do I drop my load? I feel like I have to. Like, I, I'm i literally stuck. Uh, the arms are as high as they would go. Okay, we're going to do a little no grab here. Just a little no grab. Just, just a little, little shove. Come on. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> that was almost a disaster. Okay, I'm in a very, very peculiar spot here with the trailer. This was not a good idea at all. I can't get any forward momentum. Like, my wheels are not moving. I am completely high-centered right now. Uh... Oh, 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 okay. We're, we're going to call that. That was a, definitely a cheat move there. Um, I didn't realize the trailer was going to do that. Uh, okay, we, we're still going, though. We haven't flown off the cliff. Oh, we got that going for us. Oh, my goodness. Oh, she's... Oh, that was a save. No, that wasn't a save. No, that wasn't a... Okay, well, there we go. That is no way... If somebody could do that with the truck and trailer and, like, video the whole thing, that would be amazing. I, I just don't see it happening. Um, yep, that was definitely something. All right, well, we got one more path to look at. Okay, so I went to check what the secondary start is. So there's a completely separate road. Yeah, there's a challenge board right there. Uh, yeah, so I think it utilizes the other section of map. This would be definitely for, like, an off-roader. It is a, I think, a complete dirt section. Uh, so there's a lot of challenge here and a lot more to come. Let me know what you guys think. We'll see you guys next time.